So <clears throat> this isn't uh, the last thing we'll do before we kind of get into all of our topics here. This um, I finally saw the tweet of the um, you know kind of what they do every season. They redesign all the NFL helmets. So we're gonna go through here all 32 teams here and kind of just pick which one's the best one. We'll go through. Um, you know, evaluate everyone. So kind of the criteria that we're just going to kind of throw out there. It's got to it's got to look good. Obviously, it's got to look clean. I love everything that looks clean. I don't want every, everything, you know, too busy. If it's looking clean, concise, crisp, love it. Um, so it's got to be clean got to be original we still have to know which team it is so if we're like if we're even taking like two seconds hang out what is this team supposed to be you know we got to instantly say that's not good um it still has to kind of you know um be what the original is but maybe a step up, a step above an upgraded version and it's just got to look good so we'll go through team by team here and um yeah we'll pick uh, which one is the best redesign of the nfl helmets so here we go. First one. I have not looked at these uh, either, so, you know, new to me. Um, and oh my goodness. All right. I think we got a winner right off the rip. The first one, the Tampa Bay Bucks. Holy cow. A fade to red to black with a giant skull with red eyes in the middle. Absolutely. Holy. I think we have a winner here, folks. Holy cow. This one's beautiful. Damn instantly can tell what it is it's clean i love i absolutely love the transition from light or from black to red the falcons just did it with their new uniforms this season best uniforms in the league i think um so oh i love this one god damn Alrighty, so this one's number one so far damn do they do two different ones they got two different concepts well we're not even gonna, i hate oh i don't even like this one um it's all right but uh this we're gonna uh, say that this Bucks one is the official um, entry here. The black and red with the skull, not the one with the ship that's white. Uh, it's all right. It's all right. This one's better though. So we'll count this one as the Bucks, uh, the Bucks helmet, and we've got that one as our first one. So we'll just kind of compare the next one to the last one, and if we like that one better, then we'll have that as kind of our top. So so far, the Bucks is the top. So we'll save it here. Ooh, Kansas City Chiefs. Damn. Alrighty, we're gonna keep going with um, you know, this first one because it looks like they got two different concepts here. So concept one is the one we're gonna be judging. Um, alrighty, so kind of similar to what they already have, just kind of darker colors. Uh, great redesign, but I think the Bucks one is a little bit better. Yeah, I think I like the Bucks one a lot better. So um, yeah, Kansas City, not the best. Ooh, the Packers. Damn, these are all looking real good. I love the extra kind of white stripe. They added another green. Um, kind of very similar to their original helmet, just adding that kind of white and green stripe at the bottom. Very, very good. Love the concept, but I do think that Bucks one is a little bit better. Although I do love this one. And ooh, that other, the concept two for the Packers is good too. <clears throat> That's pretty good. Uh, but we're still saying that the Bucks is better. Bucks is still the best. Ooh, Jags. And once again, kind of, um, you know, kind of like the original helmet, just kind of a darker color. And once again, we get kind of the fade from black to uh, blue. Absolutely love it. The gold Jaguar. This helmet is looking real good. All these have been damn good so far. I would implement these new helmets for every single team. Wow, damn. Um... Yeah, pretty good. I just think this Bucks one is a little bit better. I'm really digging this Bucks ones, folks. But this Jacksonville one is real good too. It's uh, a little bit too similar uh, to the original Jacksonville Jaguars helmet, so I think that's maybe the reason why uh, we like the Bucks a little bit better. Let's see their concept too. Alrighty, just a bigger Jaguars face on there. It's not a bad helmet, but um, definitely a concept too. <laughs> Alrighty, the Tennessee Titans. Alrighty, absolutely fantastic helmet this is. Um, kind of a white helmet with big old flames coming off the face mask. That's looking real good. Dang. Dang, that's looking real good. Is it better than the Bucks helmet, though? It's damn close, folks. Damn, that's close. Hmm, I love the blue face mask. That's absolutely fantastic. What's their concept two? Their concept two is not bad. Obviously, the concept one is better. Um, I think we're still going to rock with the Bucks helmet being better than the Titans, but I really think Titans is the second best that we've seen so far. This one's fantastic. Um, absolutely. I um, We're going to go with the Bucks. That's better than the Titans, but these helmets need to be implemented. These are all better than the original designs. Absolutely. So far. 
Alrighty, the Colts, not bad as well here. I'm kind of going with the Packers, kind of design a little bit. Uh, same kind of helmet that the uh, Colts have, but they add these two white stripes. So, great helmet. I don't think it's better than the Bucks one. And I don't really like this concept, too. Ooh, that's not that great. Um, Alrighty. Continuing on, Houston Texans. Alrighty, very similar to what they have, but it looks like they got the horns on each side. So I think on the other side of the helmet, you'd see the other horn as well. So good design. Two very kind of similar to what they already have. So I think we're going to say that the Bucks helmet is a little bit better than the Texans one. Um, ooh, I think I actually like their concept two a little bit better than their concept one here for the Houston Texans helmets. I think I like this one a little bit better. Actual red helmet standing out a little bit more. You got the blue te the blue um, Texan blue horn <laughs> um, Blue bowl. Is it a bowl? Um, something like that. Whatever whatever their uh, official thing is But we're saying that the uh, the Bucks one is better Alrighty now we get the Patriots. I do not like this at all. Oh this one All right, this one the Patriots Please don't implement this one every other team can but the Patriots one I'm not digging classic blue on top with the logo of the Patriots and then this red and white stripe at the end I get it. It's supposed to be the flag, but it's not coming across good to me And then you know very kind of safe here with their concept too. not bad not bad But the uh, Bucks is still better Alrighty, the New York Jets. Alrighty, very green. Don't really like the arrow. That may be the end of the jet tail. Um, but I don't even know if I would have been able to tell this one was the Jets if I didn't see the name at the top. I, w I guess I would because it's green. And that's really it. But I don't like I don't like this one at all. This one's good. Oh, their concept two is better. Damn, their concept two is nice. That's a good one. Um not better than the not better than the Bucks, but that's a solid helmet right there. Alrighty, so Bucks is still the top. Um, Alrighty, now we get the Dolphins. Mm, yeah, not that great. Kind of similar to what our design is. Um, going from white, to, you know, teal. The orange face mask is good, but that's not looking good. No, the Bucks is better, definitely better. Concept two, little bit better, little bit better. Um, the Dolphins. There's something about the shape of the helmet and the dolphin. It makes it the dolphin look. Stupid. I don't know. It's like the same thing that we've already got, but something about it. So Dolphins, I, they may have the worst one so far. What the heck is going up with that? The Jets helmet's better than the Dolphins one. I think I may like the Patriots helmet better than this one. Not good. Get it together, Miami. They give this one an A minus. Mm, I don't know who's put me in charge of judging. What'd they give this uh, Bucks one? This better be A plus. A. A, they give it A. They give this one the A+. Plus. I don't agree. I don't agree. Um, Alrighty, let's move on. So we still got Bucks as the number one helmet. Bills, why'd they give us the front view? Why'd they give us the front view of this Bills one? Damn. Um, Because this is looking good. This one's looking real good. If I could see it from the side, it'd probably be even better. But um, I don't know why they showed this one like this. Um, concept 2, very, very plain. I don't really like it at all. Uh, concept 1 is good, but we can't see it from the side view. Truly unfortunate. Um, I want to see the full bowl. I want to see the full bowl. Um, so we're going to have to say that the uh, the Bucks is still the best one. Ooh, this Bengals helmet. Ooh, this one's looking good. Some black and orange stripes. Very clean, very concise. And that is looking real good. I do like this Cincinnati Bengals helmet. Um, Concept 2 doesn't look that great. Now, is this one better than the Bucks helmet? It's close, but I think we're still going to rock with this Bucks helmet. I think this Cincinnati helmet just needed something a little oomph and extra more oomph, but for clean, concise, it's looking real good. Alrighty, so still uh, Bucks. Oh, this Pittsburgh Steelers kind of a blackout helmet. Oh, I love it that the logo is all black as well. That's super clean. You got a nice white uh, silver stripe, a nice yellow stripe as well clean face mask oh does this one is this one better than the box damn that's close concept two is not looking that great concept one i think we may have a new winner here let's quickly side by side view here damn that's so clean oof damn but that black the red transition here on this helmet is absolutely amazing Oh, man. I think we may have a tie. I think we may have a tie. Um, so let's leave both of these up. Maybe we'll get an even better one, and it won't even make these two 
notice. All right. Cleveland Browns, very classic. It's good, but nothing great. So, obviously, the other two. Ooh, the Ravens. Oh, this is what I'm talking about. Ooh, this purple's looking real nice. A, a giant B on there. And this checkered pattern fading down to the bottom. This one's absolutely great. Wow. I got some good ones here. Damn. Damn. Woof. All right, we got to make a decision. We got to narrow this down to the best one so far. Um, oh, I really love that Baltimore one. I think I think we're going to say the Steelers is the best one. I really like the Bucks, but I really love the blackout of the Steelers logo and this nice or this nice yellow at the base. So let's get rid of this Bucks one and we'll get rid of this Ravens one and now we have the Steelers as our new number 1. I can get behind that. <clears throat> Alrighty, Oakland Raiders, not bad. Very, you know, just black and white. A um, little bit too dull in my opinion. Um, their concept two is a little bit better. I do like the spade here with the with the logo on there. Not bad. But um, Steelers one is a little bit better. Broncos, very basic orange or yeah, orange and blue. Nothing great there. Nothing that's making me go wow. Same thing with Chicago. Oof. Um, trying to copy exactly what the <laughs> the Broncos did there. Uh, so not great. Um, ooh, I kind of like this one. Their concept two is a little bit better. Um, oh, the lions. Damn. Oh, pure black helmet with the blue lion coming on the side of it. This one is absolutely fantastic. I love it. Ah, I think this should be implemented as their new helmet. Um, that's real good. I do think I like the Steelers one a little bit better, but I think I may rate this as three. Steelers one, Bucks two. I think Lions. This one would be three. Damn, that's looking real good. And the concept two is not bad either. That's uh, that's actually real solid. Alrighty, we get another front view here. Absolutely hate it. So we can't really judge it too good. Um, it kind of looks very similar to what they got already for Minnesota. Uh, so we move on. The Giants. Alrighty, good helmet here. Kind of the same exact style as the Steelers have, but the Steelers one looks a little bit better. Looks a lot better, honestly. Um, I don't like this Giants helmet at, at all, honestly. Yeah, this one's not looking good. They gave it an A-. Mm, mm, we'll move on. <laughs> Philadelphia Eagles, alrighty. They kind of already have something like this with the, the, the wings coming off right off kind of like the temple of the helmet. So solid helmet, but not better than the Steelers. We're moving on. Dallas, um, ugh, same thing with like the Colts. Like I would mistake this for the Colts helmet. Gross. So we're moving on. Um, alrighty. Oh, oh, Washington. Yes. This is the new number one. Yes. Oh, you get the fade. The tra I'm telling y'all that transition from black to red is looking real nice on uniforms and helmets. I love it. Just kind of, you know, like, um, the, uh, the feathers of the headdress coming off the temple. So this is still Washington Redskin. So it's still a little offensive. So we may have to knock it down to number two because of that. Um, but dang, is this one better than the Steelers? Damn, I'm really liking that Steelers. But this one is looking real good. It's clean. It's oh, it's so clean. Whereas you know this uh, the Steelers one, you got the big logo and you kind of got you know some big colors here with the yellow clashing with the black. I still like it. Don't get me wrong. It was my number one up until this point. But I think we're gonna move on. I think Washington Redskins. They've got the new number one in my opinion. I love that black to red transition. Damn, that's looking good. All right, Washington is our new number one. All righty, let's continue on here. Carolina Panthers, uh, kind of real similar to their helmet already. Mm, yeah, very similar. Mm, we'll move on. <laughs> we'll move on. Um, oh, Atlanta looking real good. Kind of the same concept as the Washington one, the Eagles one that we just saw. Just kind of pure red. Um, if they transitioned with some black in it, I think I like it a little bit better. But definitely a solid helmet here. Um, I don't think it's better than the Washington one, so we move on. Saints. Ooh, this is real, real clean. Black helmet, huge Saints logo on the side. Uh, gold stripe coming down the middle. Very, very solid helmet. Love it. I uh, don't think it's better than Washington, and I do not like this concept, too, at all. Um, alrighty, the Rams, very kind of similar to what they already have. All yellow helmet, the blue Rams horn on the side. We move on. And this concept, too, is basically exactly like what they have already. 49ers, ugh, kind of basic. Very basic here. Um, 
yeah, real basic helmet. That's nothing good. Uh, the Concept 2, not terrible. Um, not great either. Eh, kind of a bummer here. Um, all right, 49ers got nothing good going on. Ooh, Seattle, a lot going on. A lot of blue to green transition. Very light, very loud. I like it. Uh, very solid helmet, but I do think Washington's is a little bit better. Um, I do like the look of it, though. The neon absolutely, uh, you know, splashing off the page. Not bad. Alrighty, let's move on. Ooh, the Cardinals absolutely looking real crisp, clean, just white, all white helmet with the red kind of uh, back of the Cardinal coming off. Um, kind of exactly like Washington's, but I do like Washington's better. Just that transition, folks. Um, let's get it up here. That transition. Oof, clean. Yeah, so love it, but um, do like Washington's better. Moving on, Chargers, uh, kind of basic, clean, nothing great here. We move on. Very, very basic. Is that it? That is it. Alrighty. So I think we're crowning the Washington Redskins helmet here as the best helmet out of there. And I think we then rank the Steelers one, two, probably Bucks three. Solid, solid ranking there. So if you want to see the helmets there, they're on my Twitter. We just went through them on the show. Um, but uh, yeah, little, uh, little fun Friday segment there.